Hi Smart Traders, it's Lucas from Contrib. Welcome to this channel which helps you to develop your algorithmic trading strategies and increase your profits. Today I will show you the mistake to avoid to create a deep learning algorithmic trading strategy. Let's get started. All the code that I will use in this video comes from my course Deep Learning for Algorithmic Trading. So I will not detail how to create a deep learning algorithmic trading strategy, but I will just highlight you the stochastic initialization weight problem in this video. For example, here I have created a RNN recurrent neural network using TensorFlow. And we have the profits of this strategy which is based on the recurrent neural network prediction. The problem here is that as we have a lot of noise in the financial data, it's very difficult for the algorithm to find the global minimum. It means that when you will train your algorithm, it will find a local minimum. And it means that your training will not be optimal. To show you this problem, I will show you the same algorithm with the same parameter on the same asset on the same period etc with the same parameter and we will just make the training again and again and I will show you the different performance when we train the same algorithm on the same asset 100 times. As we can see even if we have trained our algorithm on the same asset on the same period and using the same neural network we have many different results and this problem comes from two factors first the financial data have a lot of noise and usually when you will train a neural network you will use a stochastic gradient descent and the fact that the initial weight are randomly initialized and that the financial data contain very noise imply that we can have a lot of different performance. So it means that you need to be careful when you want to use deep learning for algorithmic trading. However, there are many solutions to fix this issue. I have shown you one solution in my course, Deep Learning for Algorithmic Trading. You can find the link to this course in the description. And for those of you who want other solution, you can wait and tell me if you want another video about this subject. There will be many demands about it. I will make a second part of this video. Don't hesitate to like and subscribe, it's very essential for my SEO.